Hey, what's going guys? Jason Respawn here, and this is how you save on a lot of money on buying a, a pre-built PC by iBuyPower and kind of like CyberPower. And I think Cyber CyberPower Neutron or something like that. Uh, one sec, I think it's right here. Do 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 Cybertron PC or whatever. I don't. I have no idea. They might be down low on their PCs. But anyway, uh, this is how you save on a lot of money on your PC. Cause if you guys go and customize your PC off of CyberPower, some parts will be more expensive than others. And what I did to solve that was, obviously, I have an iBuyPower Gaming Power AM six forty nine. Uh, FX desktop right here, which that is four ninety nine, no five hundred dollars, straight four ninety nine point ninety nine, AMD FX uh, forty one thirty processors three point eight gigahertz, eight gigabytes of DDR three RAM, one thousand two uh, and twenty four gigabytes of uh, five uh, five thousand four hundred RPM hard drive, AMD Radeon HD sixty four fifty. Windows 7 Home Premium 64-bit, and that's basically all on the that computer. But what we don't need is the power supply and the graphics card. So basically, now then we're going on to an upgraded graphics card, which that would be an MSI GeForce GTX 660, two gigabyte. This is. First, the, the I buy power was at Amazon. Now this is at Newegg, uh, and everything's at dot com. So obviously everything's in U.S. And what's really cool about this uh, graphics card, the MSI GeForce GTX 660 two gigabyte video card, uh, it's SLI support ready, so you can add like one more other uh, uh, 660. If you went with a TI, then then you can do three-way SLI, but for just a normal 660, you can only do two-way SLI. And what's really, really cool with this, you get a free Splinter Cell Blacklist purchase with this. Uh, limited time offer, so if you guys are looking for a graphics card, and go with this one. Or a little bit higher ones and all that, because they start in the cell, Splinter Cell Blacklist purchases with them. So if you guys want to go a little bit higher, then get like the 670 or something like that, or the 770 or something like that. I don't know, but this is $214, so that's actually a really good price and sell. Straight uh, $499.99 for the desktop, then plus... Uh, two hundred and fourteen dollars for the uh, for the graphics card then you're like hey you're not gonna have enough power supply for that so then we went with a 600 watt power supply which that if you guys want uh, we have a 750 watt here if you guys want to go with that which uh, the 600 watt would be seventy five dollars on sale for fifty nine dollars so fifteen dollars off twenty percent so then that's a uh, plus seventy five dollars seventy four point ninety nine equals seven hundred eighty nine dollars guys so that's actually pretty a good deal if you guys were gonna get like a six sixty graphics card and decent shit in it you guys would have been probably spending around probably a grand or something like that so it's it's easy to mix pre-built and uh and uh, not pre-built just putting in your own shit because obviously uh obviously the most easiest things to remove is the power supply and the GPU those are like and the CPU cooler wait i'm not sure about the CPU cooler because disconnected from the CPU i don't know about that but uh I'm not sure if you can disconnect the CPU cooler, but I know the power supply and the GPU are the most easiest. So that would come up to seven hundred eighty-nine dollars and ninety-seven cents. So that's actually pretty cheap. You, uh, if you're doing a thousand-dollar gaming PC build, you would have a uh, like two hundred dollars more to spend. If you guys have extra change laying around, obviously you can uh, spend a little bit more. If you guys want, you guys can go with like sixteen gigabytes of DDR3 RAM. Corsair Vengeance or something like that. Uh, eight gigabytes or uh, eight gigabytes will probably be around like a hundred dollars or whatever. I'm pretty sure. 
But I don't know, but I'll put the, all these links down in the description below if you guys want to go with this. This is what I'm actually going to do with my PC if I ever get one. I'm probably going to buy a pre-built, obviously, then basically then take out the graphics card if it comes with the graphics card, and take out the power supply, because uh, I want to get the cheapest uh, PC, but the most ex like most powerful, because I want to get the processor over 3.0 gigahertz because that's where well, uh, that's where like downloading everything and pc gaming but overall the cpu on this uh pc is just fabulous it's 3.8 gigahertz imagine overclocking it it will probably be like 4.9 like, gigahertz or something like that i have no idea but it seems really really cool and uh, i'm pretty sure you would have a lot of fun gaming on it and also with the pc it comes with a little uh uh gaming keyboard and mouse so if you guys don't have that you guys comes with that and you guys uh, with the graphics card you have a free splinter cell blacklist coming with that so that's a 50 dollar game originally sixty dollars if you guys are just gonna buy it on games but if you're gonna buy it offline or whatever it's probably gonna be around fifty bucks but anyway that uh, was a great uh, deal if you guys want to go with that uh, save a lot of money if you guys were just gonna build a normal i buy power or cyber power gaming pc with the same products right there then it will probably be coming around like a grand so i just saved you like two hundred bucks so Hope you enjoyed, guys. If you did, leave a like and add this video to your favorites and subscribe to my channel. And catch you in my next video. And peace. Yeah. Foremost, so fuck you to my enemy.